Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 15th Annual Den Public School Foundation Groundhog Day Gala, celebrating our 22nd year of support for the Den Independent School District. We thank you for your attendance at tonight's event. Over the past year, many individuals, businesses, and organizations have graciously given to the foundation. We're pleased to recognize and honor them this evening and invite you to know a little more about each of these generous supporters. Your program includes more detailed information about tonight's honorees. Although our donors are a diverse group, they share one common theme, their desire to give back to our community by strengthening and enhancing the power of education. Tonight we honor Balfour Beatty, a $25,000 Crystal Level donor, establishing a $10,000 Balfour Beatty 2017 grant to teachers, a $10,000 Balfour Beatty 2017 construction student scholarship, and $5,000 to the Balfour Beatty Special Projects Fund, supporting special or immediate needs for school projects. And being around young people and being in the K-12 education environment really affords you an opportunity to to give back in the same way that someone gave to you decades before. Saco and Burroughs PC, a $12,500 gold level donor, establishing a $10,000 endowment for the Saco and Burroughs 2017 Student Scholarship and $2,500 added to their Saco and Burroughs Support Our School Fund, supporting immediate needs for special campus projects during the year. I can't tell you how exciting it is to, number one, give a scholarship to a child in the district. It's it's probably one of the most rewarding things you're going to do. Local business folks like us, even though we're a small law firm, uh, need to step up. And we've been committed to that at Stockholm Burroughs since our inception a little over 20 years ago. Mike and Delaney Gregory, a $40,000 Crystal Level donor, establishing the new $20,000 Delaney Gregory Endowment for Early Childhood Education and adding $10,000 each to their existing Mike Gregory Teacher Scholarship Endowment and the Gregory Family Scholarship bringing each of these to $20,000 endowments. It's important to enhance education of students and for teachers to be able to get grants or scholarships for their further the education is enhances the life of the students as it helps the teachers. I have always loved early childhood. I think people need to recognize how important um, those early years are and um, so we need to educate those kids and we're very lucky in Denton because we have a great pre-k program. Shelly Anthony, a $20,000 Crystal Level donor, establishing the new Buster Cray Golf Scholarship Endowment in memory of her father, a lover of life and golf to support the continuing education of a graduating senior who participated on the golf team in high school. Our family feels that college the college experience and getting a college education affects our lifelong dreams and I feel like this would be a way to help them fulfill some of those dreams. The Telefiero Family and Friends, a $13,000 plus gold level donor, establishing the new Richard Dickey Telefiero Student Scholarship to honor the late Richard Dickey Telefiero a proud graduate of the Denton High School class of 1957 who overcame many challenges and was an inspiration to many. We chose to give back to the community in this way because my dad gave to me and my brother uh, in helping us with our education along the way and so we want to be able to help someone else. We were raised to be part of a community and to believe in a community and whether that's through our church or through volunteer work or through education it doesn't matter, we're out there always trying to make a difference. And my brother helped set that example through his disability. He showed many others how to walk and talk the road. The Carrico Family and Friends, a $15,000 plus gold level donor, establishing the new Coach Bill Carrico and Dr. Happy Carrico Student Scholarship Endowment to honor the long-time service of two dedicated Denton ISD educators and administrators. This scholarship will benefit a DISD student with a parent who has given 10 or more years of service to the district. This, I feel like my dad taught me that, that you know, we need to further people's education. The most valuable assets we have are um, people. The Kerner Family and Friends, a $2,500 term endowment establishing the new Larry Kerner Memorial Grant to Teachers in loving memory of Larry and recognizing his longtime commitment and support to teachers, especially for his wife, Donna, 
a DISD retiree, and daughter Shelby, currently teaching at Hawk Elementary. Well, this is very important to us because my husband helped so much support Shelby and I as we were going through our education and becoming teachers. He came up and helped us at all the school functions and everything, and we just wanted to give back to the teachers because as we know, teachers never seem to have enough money in their budget. Memorializing him and remembering him, showing people throughout the district who he was, that's why it's important to me. Dad Coup, a $2,500 term endowment, establishing the Dad Coup 2017 grant to teachers, continuing Dad Coup's longtime support of Denton ISD, a hallmark of the credit union's commitment to teachers and their dedication to excellence in the classroom. Well, the community's always been good to us. Um, teachers, you know, it was always the number one thing that started the credit union. And in this way, it's just another way to repay them. The time and effort that they put in for our kids uh, is just invaluable, and we want to help any way that we can. Anthony and Lorena Salas, a $2,500 term endowment, establishing the Buena Vista Student Scholarship in partnership with their business, Buena Vista Painting, Anthony, a DPSF board member, and Lorena, principal at Lee Elementary, are creating this scholarship to support students who attend a non-traditional college or technical school. CoServe, a $25,000 crystal level donor. This year, CoServe gave a very generous $25,000, enabling the foundation to give four scholarships to graduating seniors, 22 grants to teachers, three staff scholarships, and two school-wide initiatives, in addition to their other grants to teachers established over the years. This gift underscores the commitment CoServe has given to DISD to support its teachers and students. We think that supporting the teachers is critical in this process. Um, you know, we're all looking for the next generation of workers, and we talk about having well-educated, well-trained students, but without teachers to educate that next workforce, um, they're not going to be there. They, they won't exist without good, highly qualified, highly educated teachers. Dr. George and Betty Jane Morrison, a $10,000 plus gold level donor, establishing the New Beginning Social Service Fund, a special contribution to support the needs of Denton ISD students and their families as they face unexpected challenges. Because the Morrisons believe that all children deserve a safe and warm place to live with their families so they can grow, learn, and thrive. I feel that the Lord put on my heart that I had to do something to help homeless children. I could think of nothing worse than not having a place to be or a place to go. Money to help pay for rent, utilities, motel stays for children and their families, particularly children birth to age eight, so that we can prevent homelessness, we can provide children with a home of their own, let them stay together as a family, that's essential. Keeping families intact, keeping families off the street, keeping families together. I Teach Texas, a goal level donor, establishing the I Teach Texas Teach Denton Scholarships to support Denton ISD's Teach Denton program. This will enable the program to give a $6,000 scholarship to a student attending Texas Woman's University and a $4,000 scholarship for a student attending North Central Texas College, both of whom intend to pursue a career in education. Individuals that the district has already identified with dispositions to become educators. So we're taking from that candidate pool and then awarding scholarships so they can continue that education at the college and university level. Dan and Laura Cress, a bronze level donor. In conjunction with their business and to encourage students to enter the construction profession, Dan and Laura Cress are establishing the CBS Mechanical Incorporated Technology Scholarship for a $2,500 scholarship given to a student who will attend a technical school or college with the intent of going into the field of construction sciences. Den Chamber of Commerce, a silver level donor. The Den Chamber of Commerce this year donated $5,400 from its sponsorship of the Den ISD New Employee Welcome Reception. This funding supports new teachers beginning their careers in DISD. With this funding, the foundation was able to award seven grants to teachers for innovative classroom projects and help to enhance the first year experience for these teachers. And as a business community, we are very much interested in helping to further the resources and supporting our educators in any way that we can in 
understanding that education is a very vital component in the future workforce. Again, the Denton Public School Foundation would like to thank all the individuals, families, and organizations that have made tonight possible. Thank you for your support. And now, please welcome Jackie Jackson back to the stage to introduce these honorees.